Okay, this little drill will help if you have trouble with your back elbow pulling away behind your rib cage, causes your arms to separate, hands to come off the club. Pretty simple. Uh, just take your left arm, reach across, grab right above your right elbow joint, as you can see here. And just kind of keep that feel. As you can see me doing this first section, the right arm kind of stays straight. Then the wrist is going to start to hinge, the elbows folded a little bit. Uh, but the, the sensation here is if you pull that elbow behind your ribcage because your arm is configured across your chest, the right bicep will leave the hand and you'll feel it. So that's kind of where we see most of your modern good players at the top with the, with the arm. It's not retracted behind the ribcage. I know it doesn't look that way from this perspective, but trust me when you feel the drill you'll you'll understand the sensations I'm trying to convey with this um, versus that right so that causes the the hand to no longer have contact with the bicep the elbow starts to feel like it pulls behind you which is probably good in baseball doesn't work too good in golf so that's this view and then once you get the feel you can obviously reach up put your left hand on the club and and create a couple seconds of feel with that. And then here I'm just gonna show you the front view. Reach up, grab it, go, okay, I've gotta probably do this a couple hundred times to get the feel. May not take that many, okay? Some people can learn certain things much faster than others, but it's a general goal is enough reps to create a feel, and the feedback is the right, sorry, the left hand touching the right bicep above the elbow so that we can create the arm structure that we want that doesn't allow that, okay?